Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. You're here with me, Stevie K. Guys, I'm checking out the trailer, I believe, trailer of Anna Burani, the goddess of food. It's got Nayantara in it, uh, starring Nayantara and directed by Nilesh Krishna. Uh, music composed by Tamanes. So, um, don't know nothing much about it, but it says the goddess of food. So, obviously, it's related to food. Um, and I'm just gonna take it from there. I don't know what Anna. Burani means. Uh, I don't know if that's a name or if that's anything else, but write that in the comments below. What do you guys, if you guys know anything more. Guys, if you're new to our channel, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, also check out the channel, which is cool. I'll touch links will be in the description below. And do let us know what else to react to. Obviously, Niyantra, I believe, is the girl who's in Jiwan with Shah Rukh Khan. So, uh, anyway, I'm going to check this one out and see what it's like. Here we go. Welcome to India's best chef. Okay. Yes. Something different. The competition pala chef gala uruvaaki irukke. Pala per avangaloda kanavugal adaiya valiya irukku. Nana India le best chef ava uncle. Kanavula kota kattada. Theruvula cricket velayadravanga ellarume Sachin Tendulkar aaya mudiyadhu. First contestants ellarum super star aaga mudiyadhu. Pudichada panna lakshathile oruthar illama. Lakshan perume super star aaga. Yeah. The first room or freestyle room. Oh man and her. And your time starts now. Anapurni, pavanna. Ni matto po propose panna. Dana avana the okay pani thugin peduva. And now we've come to today's surprise part. प्रसाद निक्रांज And let's get those burners on fire. In theatre, first of December, so uh, this week, Friday. Um, yeah, something different because um, I haven't seen anything like this. Like you know, uh, obviously we see movies about competitiveness competitions and stuff like that but it's normally in a sporting sort of world um not often is it something like this uh you can see straight from the starting kind of thing uh, a woman in a sort of a man's world because most of the chefs men there uh but then it's not just what she wants to do and like you know follow her dream but I'm guessing it was a mum at the starting, basically, that, you know, not every person wants to play cricket or become like Sachin. Uh, you know, so not every bus conductor can become a superstar. Um, so, you know, that kind of feeling and mentality of, you know, not to pursue your dreams, you know, do, you know, probably get education if it's, you know, get married, have a job and, you know, be safe, secure. Um, but she's stepping into a total unknown world that she, but she believes in herself. But then what ends up happening is that middle bit of her culture, religion, upbringing, uh, and everything of, you know, what she's grown up to believe and what her family believes, who she, you know, where she's come from. And then sort of like being having that but also having this dream that she wants to sort of fulfilled so where she's come from and where she's going kind of thing you know all those that things that she has to the choices she has to make the things that she has to overcome uh you know 
things that she has to believe in. People, including family and everyone else, beliefs, religion, whatever it is, that things that she has to sort of face. You know, it seems like that. It doesn't just seem like a competition that she's like, you know, Anapurani, the goddess of food. It's not just that. It's what, how she's going to, you know, change everything else around her and everyone else around her by becoming this person who's got to follow her dreams and make things happen. Uh, it seems like that. So she has got, you know, it's not just as simple as this is my dream and I'm going to do it, but it's about overcoming every sort of thing or, you know, understanding everything that she sort of used to believe in or her family believes in and then uh, changing her perspective to because her dream sort of matters and I think that's what it sort of shows later on when she grabs that knife and then she comes back in but it's still it's going to be how that does her dream what it does for her and also everyone else around her I believe but also what in this world I'm guessing you know what the men and everyone else thinks as well so uh, it's all those things it's obviously it's going to be about overcoming your insecurities your fears your beliefs your you know your value whatever it might be it's going to be overcoming and um, seeing so much more or making people understand so much more that's that's what i'm getting from it but it seems good is it's it and i think the main thing was something different which uh, you know at the moment we know all the kind of movies and things that are coming out so we've got to give uh, new things and different things a chance and you know and like I said, there's not many chef kind of movies or different kind of challenges and competitions and sort of um, inspirational kind of films. And I feel like this could be, but yet also touching on subjects that, you know, people might understand, might not understand kind of thing. So, but become more aware of. But anyway, that was, and not only that, uh, a female orientated film as well i think that makes a big difference as well which is good in this day and age um that was the trailer that was a reaction let me know in the comments below what do you guys think don't forget to like share subscribe and we'll see you on the next one take care see you soon bye